Law of Conservation of Energy Objective To learn the law of conservation of energy Energy is ability to do work. It can be found in one of six forms chemical, electrical, thermal, mechanical, gravitational or nuclear. The law of conservation of energy tells us that energy, no matter which of these forms it's in, cannot be created or destroyed, but it may be changed from one form to another. When we switch on a light bulb, electrical energy will be transformed into light energy and heat energy. In this case, one form of energy has been changed into two other forms. Let's see how this law operates in nature. Our sun is the major source of energy for our earth. The nuclear reactions in the sun convert nuclear energy into electromagnetic energy. The electromagnetic energy from the sun will reach the earth in the form of light and heat. Some of this energy will be used by plants to produce more energy in the form of food. The energy found in plants will move through the ecosystem and the food chain, passing from one trophic level to the other. Some of this solar energy will also heat the seas and oceans and evaporate water. Some of the energy will convert water vapor back into water in the form of rain, which can be trapped behind a dam. The elevated water behind a dam has potential energy. As the water falls, the potential energy will be converted to kinetic energy. The energy will rotate the turbine of a generator and produce electrical energy. Summary The law of conservation of energy states that energy cannot be created or destroyed, but it may be changed from one form to another.